See this? This is my boomstick! Hi everyone, Boomstick here from Renegade Racing. Today we're looking at the Elite Grand Prix Round 4 for the Tron Nemesis. And uh, let's have a look at the course. It is Friendly Neighborhood in New York. And uh, I'll be going through the practice run first to get the conditions and then I'm going to do a more speedier run. However, I will say that I am in a hurry today and so I am not um, pushing to get the best possible time for that. You might want to check out some other creators. But anyway, let's get on with it. We need to do five perfect nitros and four jumps today. So jump in the uh, free tri gold trion and let's see what we can do. Now, the friendly neighborhood, I haven't actually played this much um, so uh, my depth of knowledge is probably uh, not the best, though I don't think many people have been playing it that much, so uh, I'm not even sure if it's available any other way. So let's have a look. All right, so you want to uh, just hold on to the nitro here, and then we'll just trigger it and do our perfect nitro first time in the air holding drift, and then we'll just get a bit of speed, and then we're going to start drifting here, just building up some nitros so that we can do our perfect nitros. And we'll just start triggering them as we go through the course here. Um, just, you know, we're not focusing on time, so we just want to drift a bit here and um, get those perfect nitros done. And just making sure that we get at least five of them done. And we did all the jumps. All right, <clears throat> hopefully that should have been enough. I think I did do five. Let's have a look. Okay, so we finished the race, we got the perfect nitros, and we did the four jumps. All right, so that's our first look at the <coughs> friendly neighborhood. Now let's go through a speedier run. I'll just see what's in the pack here. <laughs> Lots of TC for me. Uh, most of these cars, I'd say most people have, but uh, it might help some of the newer players. Anyway. Let's now go through a run where we actually focus on getting our top speed up and getting across the line as quickly as possible. Now I have seen people doing 30.8s and 30.6, so uh, it is possible to do this course quite fast, um, but we really want to just uh, do a quick run here that will give you the basic outline of the route, um, and then that way you can work on it from there. All right, let's go. Now it is a tricky start and you do want to do this uh, 360 here at the top very uh, precisely. So you want to trigger your Nitro then trigger your 360 so that you do get that um, speed and then obviously building up into a shockwave and we'll do maybe a little bit of a drift there. Um, I didn't drift but you should probably do a little bit more of a drift to build up a bit more Nitro. You jump up on here and then you want to shoot diagonally across here and then perhaps line yourself up to ride the wall. Um, I didn't in this instance and then just trying to avoid the walls as you go through and push out your nitro. All right, 31.7, um, that's gonna put me in third place in my pod, um, which is a reasonably competitive pod, but um, I will say that this is not the best run and it's a very luck dependent track or it feels like that. Um, obviously the Treon bounces around and stuff. So it probably will take you quite a few goes to get a good time. And uh, hopefully you're in a pod that isn't too uh, hard to deal with. But yeah, that's the basic outline. I have toyed around with doing 360s after the bridge um, and they do seem to not quite uh, provide you with enough stability. Um, though you should be drifting in the air um, after you've expended your nitro to build up more nitro. It's all about nitro management, this one. All right, everyone, hopefully that's gonna give you enough to go on. Um, put up any questions in the comments. I am quite busy today, but I will try and get back to you. And if you are new to the channel, please give me a like and subscribe up there. All right, everyone, good luck with this part of the Grand Prix and uh, take care. Bye for now.